Hey guys, what's up? It's Captain SNES back here with another session video. Today I want to go around some more spots, maybe back at the New York ledges, see if we can find anything hidden, any high gaps or anything like that, and I finally learned how to do late flips, so we can do some of those too. First things first, I changed it to nighttime because I like the aesthetic. And we actually have to go to the pyramid ledges. Alright, so we're here at the pyramid ledges, and there's some scaffolding. I don't know, there's those buildings right there, but those are out of bounds. Some more scaffolding up there, you know, typical New York stuff. Uh, there's a little area up there. Oh, actually, there's a stairway over here I didn't see before. If you can't tell, I haven't been here. Oh, yeah, never mind. Stairway that you cannot get up. Stairway over here. I wish there was... Oh, there's not actually a platform right here. It's all just opened. Actually, you know what? Maybe, just like last time, I built my way outside of the map. So maybe this time I can build my way up there and then do some kind of trick off of that into the street. I think that'd be nice, right? Okay, step two, make some ramps. So this ramp right here looks like it could be just good enough to get us up onto here and then jump on over to right here. I mean, that's not a very big gap to jump, so uh, hopefully we can get up here and actually skate it. All right, so I did need to change one ramp. That first one needed to conjoin to the third one because uh, jumping from the second one below all of that to the third one was just not possible. So uh, let's go up here now. Okay, over this little bump. And of course I would jump right over it the first time. Why wouldn't I? All right, now that we're up here and this is like a high ledge, let's try one of those late flips because I just recently figured out how to do those. So... We'll do some kind of late flip, maybe add like a 360 or something. I mean, that's a pretty large drop for any kind of trick we want to do. I'm not going to be calling late flips or anything here, because I really don't know which way I flick my stick is going to make what kind of late flip. So we're just going to go for a late flip 360, make it that simple. And of course I don't get it right first try. Alright, let's try that again. Okay, so we got to go got to do an ollie flick back and I can't seem to start spinning after that so maybe I need to start spinning first okay so we're gonna go for the ollie trigger oh okay late back foot heel is there any way to make me land that let me just jump off of this and see if I can land it okay I can land to right there but can I land any farther than that so let's try to do like a ollie out into the street and I landed that. Okay, it seems that we just need to land straight and then we can do it. Alright, so we're going to push and do an ollie spin and flick the back one. Okay, that would... <laughs> we didn't spin there. Ollie flick and the rotation doesn't work unless you do it first. Ollie spin up and I... I gotta get the spin down. I keep not doing the spin. The flick is fine. Like, I think... Oh god, now I'm in switch. The flick is fine. I can do late back foot heel. All right, we're going to do a late back foot heel 360 down this. I'm not going to be calling late flips or anything. Late back foot heel 360 down this. I'm not going to be calling late flips or anything. Right, now that we know what we're doing. Almost. Almost. I had the flick really late in there for whatever reason, but almost. Late back foot heel. I don't, that was not, that was not quite a 360. That was a 180. I think we can go for the 360 because like I said, that is a pretty big drop. You should be able to get a 360 off of that. But maybe it's whatever I'm doing that's impeding me from doing that. Okay, so I just watched the same footage back that you guys just saw, and that was actually a 540. It didn't feel like a 540, but apparently it was. I did call out a 360, so I'm going to try to stay true to that and actually do a 360. Hopefully it won't take me too long, but I'll be back as soon as I get that. Ollie, spin, flick, and almost. Ollie, spin, flick. And I'm overdoing it. I'm making 540s all the time. Push, flick. Uh, and I forgot to spin. I feel like it's making me over-rotate a little bit. Come on, I tried to tweak it back a little bit and it just decided not to work. I'm landing it straight. I don't get it. At this point, I might just conclude that the game doesn't want me to do it.
We finally did it. There was a little bit of a tweak back to the left, but I finally did it. Okay, just the 360, not the 540. I think that took a little longer than it should have, as just about any trick I actually call out does. But it's alright. We got it. I feel like there's some really good spots around here. Like this rail, I mean, you could try to grind that entire thing down there. That would be a really cool trick. But yeah, you could try to do like a slide all the way across this. And I feel like that's definitely what it's meant for. I hope the game recognizes that that can be done. One thing that would be really cool in this game is to see if there's anywhere that you could do like a roof to roof gap. But for now, I think I'm going to try to do this slide. See if it's even somewhat possible. Attempt number one. And we don't even hit it. I mean, what are the chances? Come on. Okay. That, that was nothing. <laughs> please, please tell me that the game lets you do this. I'm going to try going at it from a little more of an angle. See what happens. Okay, that can be done. That was like almost no speed and I could get halfway through that. So we can definitely get through the entire thing. Like, grab one of these and throw them around over here for some extra run up. Okay, I think I've just created the tabletop run up. Let's see how this helps us. Okay, that was pretty far across. Granted, we started like here. But we got to here. I'd say that's like a good, I don't know, 60% of it? 66%? You know, two-thirds? Try it again. Okay, I think we're going to need to call in some uh, ramps to give us a little bit more speed. Man, I still have my area set is up here. I think some extra ramps going upwards should do the trick. So it turns out from my very little looking around the uh, parts menu for building, these bumps are the closest thing we have to uh, going straight down with rails. How good could it really be? I don't know. We're going to find out. going to actually save our spot up here. Now time to go down. Okay. That's definitely more speed. If I could hit it. If I could hit the rail. I just need to orient myself the right way so that I can go straight down these. And then just, I don't know, maybe if I just turn a little bit into the bank. so close it went into a nose grind but it didn't actually nose grind i feel like that could have been it right there that could have been really close or it was really close this is really tricky just trying to hit that when you're going that speed it's all about timing okay 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 and it kicks me off. Okay, do I need to turn? Do I need to turn somehow? I feel like I'll never figure that out, but that was pretty good. Okay, okay, I turned myself. And kickflip out? It kickflip up? Okay, all right, all right. But at least we know how to get around that bank a little bit more this time. Okay, right here. Of course, <laughs> gonna tease me like that. Seems like we can't stay on that loop anymore. We hit it, but then we just can't stay on it. Okay, backside tail. I think that trick would look really good here, if I could hit it. That would have been it. If I just turned, like if I just rotated while I did that, it would have been perfect. That was kind of disgusting. I swear, that was it. That was it. But like, I don't know. Something will happen. That 
That was so good for like half a second. Okay, we're calling that trick. I am I'm done spending time on it. Maybe we'll uh, revisit it at some other point in time. But in the meantime, I think that... Uh, damn, I just said time a lot right there. But in the meantime, I think we should go for something else. I think maybe we should look around the different areas of the map. Get out of the uh, ledges, the NYC ledges. Go somewhere else. Do some other tricks. So this rail right here. It's uh, kinked two, three times, something like that. It's kinked quite a few times. And it looks like something that would be gnarly as hell to ride down. I've done it before, but I just want to redo it for this video. One, because I don't think I ever actually recorded it. And two, because Session just uploaded a clip this past week on their Instagram page of someone skating this rail, and they couldn't seem to do it. But I could. I don't know, it could have just been a joke, but I'm going to go for it again. So there's no real method to this one. You just kind of start back here, save your spot, and go at the rail a couple times. <laughs> That's probably the best thing I've ever seen. Jesus Christ, what was that? So we did our ollie onto the rail, except we missed the rail right here, and we went down onto the curb. And then the game tried to make us grind the curb, and then the steps came along and ruined our day and made a ton of weird sounds as we were just nicking every one of those <laughs> little steps. Jesus. And then we hit down here and we're grinding right here under the rail. This rail is going straight through my body at this point. We're grinding along and we hit these stairs. And then I guess our body finally wants to hit the rail because if you look... Our legs kind of separate, and this right one gets caught by the rail? What was that? Alright, whatever that last attempt was, we're just going to forget about it for now. But it, it was interesting. And we hit it again! Okay, it didn't do the same retarded sound thing, but, I mean, I can hit the top. Alright, again, if we could hit the rail this time, that would be nice. We hit the rail, and we just go flying. Okay. Hit the rail. Don't hit the rail. I don't know what it is, but my character just wants to walk into the sidewalk, not the rail. We got the same weird glitch again. What was that all about? Okay. Hit the rail this time, not the sidewalk. That is our only objective here. And we face plan into the sidewalk. Yeah. Okay, we're going to board slide this one. I have figured that out by now that I want to board slide it because I don't think it... It'll let me backside tail the sidewalk. Okay. I was going to say, I don't think it'll let me board slide the sidewalk, but apparently I could be wrong about that one. Okay, maybe this rail is cursed. I'm just going to say, this rail is cursed. Oh, backside Susky from the rail down below. Okay. There's something going on here. Did they update this rail? Okay, stay in the sussy grind. Boom, ollie. Okay, it wasn't a kickflip or anything, but it's an ollie. And we rode away from it until there. I can call that a win. Okay, I think I'm going to end the video there. Thank you guys so much for watching. If there's any kind of tricks you want me to try, send me a video. Send me a comment down in the comments below telling me what trick you want me to do and where. And I will attempt to do it for this video series. Because it seems that you guys at least enjoy Session a little bit, and I enjoy making the videos, so I hope I can keep making them. Be sure to look down below in the description for me and Julian the Sauce God's Discord channel. You can join that if you want to talk to us, maybe talk to us about some new videos, some ideas you have, some new tricks. Maybe that's another place that you could put them besides the comments. Other than that, don't forget to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe for more. This has been Captain SNES. Peace out.